Hey guys, on today's episode of Urban Catfishing, we are tossing big fuzzy jigs for some big big cat. Now, we've been having a good good luck here in this little this little current path here. Um, now what I've been doing is just kind of taking this and pitching it out there, working it back real slow, and uh, they've been pretty pretty aggressive about it, so we'll give it a shot here. times. I'm just letting it sit there for a little bit. Oh, oh just messed. See, I've been using this brown here, and for some reason it works pretty well. I'm using a 27-inch uh, whiteout with uh, two pound test action. We're just playing these kitties out pretty good. I'm not getting a good reaction, just slow roll on the bait. Sometimes I'll just start burning it. Yeah, I see nothing, nothing there. Nice with you, can sight fish them. You know what I'm going to do here, guys? I'm going to change up baits real quick here. Hang on a second. I'm going to actually switch to a plug and see if we can't get some top water action going here. Today the weather conditions are uh, pretty cold. Sun's out. So I suppose mid 20s here. Just had a front come through yesterday, so we're uh, we're going after these things post front, which isn't always easy to do. But uh, you know we're we're really trying to get a get a good late season push here and see what happens with these cats. Now. <clears throat> second here. I'm fishing solo today, which I usually don't do. usually have a, a partner or two with. I'm trying to film this as uh, solo as I can, but let's just kind of show you just a normal fisherman's knot here. And boy, my eyes are getting kind of bad. So... Pull that through and tighten that up. Get your tag on that off. Alright. And I'm going to add a little bit of weight. Just a uh, little eighth ounce, little eighth ounce uh, gremlin here. Snap on weight. Just to keep it in the current a little bit better. Otherwise, some of these top waters just skid right into the backwater, and we don't want that. So, basically, just a big yellow and red plug with a little bit of weight on it. Throwing that out there, wave. Oh. Ah. Dang it. Oh boy. This is uh, one of those deals about fishing, you know fishing alone, you can just really set a hook without worrying about anybody else's teeth or eyes or anything like that, you know. And like I said, I'm using light tackle today, but, uh, oh, 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 ah, here we go, here we got a fall, oh, we got a fall, oh, oh, jeez, holy buckets, that was exciting, let's try that again. It's just exciting, isn't it? You know, they hit that top water plug and just really gets you going. Oh, oh, gosh! You know, just really gets you excited to just power on through and throw another one of those out there. So, 
some of these bigger cats are they're hitting the big plugs with the little cats, you know. They're just inhaling, just inhaling these plugs. another looker. They're popping that bait and they're just, they're spitting it right away. Ah, oh, jeez. I'm gonna go hungry if it keeps up like this, guys. Exciting, huh? From what I could see, it wasn't a real big cat. Still got the blood going. Let's see if we can't pick another one up here. Oh, oh. You know, sight fishing, it's, it's a really big riot, you know. Ah, bad cast. Exciting, huh? I don't know if you guys were with us last week, but uh, why did we have some fun? Alright guys, that's all the time we have for today, and uh, we'll check back in next week.